Hi, I'm Nikki Lund. I am a fashion designer and a singer, and I get to work with some of today's top celebrities, from Blake Shelton to Britney Spears, Miley Cyrus, Carrie Underwood, Brad Paisley, um, and that's just to name a few. So I decided I'm going to launch a YouTube channel, and I think I have about 15 viewers. So to kick it off and show you guys how I build my brand and actually build my following on this channel, I'm going to show you a behind the scenes of a very, very exciting new project that I get to work on with one of my favorite clients, Blake Shelton, and his goddess girlfriend, Gwen Stefani. She is... She's my pop princess. She is just, I love her. I love her energy. And uh, since I was a little girl, I listened to I'm Just a Girl. And she always made me feel so good about myself and being a woman. And so if I can do something in return for that, this is what I'm going to do. And I will show you how I do it from making patterns to sketching a design, picking out fabric, and working with an amazing team um, to make this happen. So. I hope you enjoy and stay tuned. Hi, I'm Nikki Lund and today we're going to look at a few steps in the process of making Blake Shelton's custom clothes. It's kind of exciting and fun and I want to bring you into my behind the scenes world and show you what we do. So to start, I have a piece of fabric that I like to work with. It's a little bit um, thicker and it's easy to draw on and I start by pinning it onto the body form. So here's the body form and as you can see I've already started pinning it and marking out the chest area. So now this form is a little bit smaller um, so I have to account for the measurements to make the actual pattern a little bit larger on this body so I'm bringing it back further a few inches than I normally would for this body form because it's for Blake and he's a lot bigger <laughs> than this. So we pin this on here and I begin tracing And these lines, these, these darker lines are going to be the lines that I follow on the body form. All the way down to here. And as you see, I'm just marking this. I'm going to bring it in here. shoulder. So I like to use my ruler to make sure it's exactly. Sometimes I can just eye it. But for filming's sake, I'll show you the ruler that I'm using. So bring it to here. So what we do is once I've done an outline, this is for the front left, I start cutting out this pattern piece.
and cut this out. Now what I've done is I've extended the shoulder to here and elongated the armhole. Now, we're almost done here. 